and welcome to a brand new series which we'll be starting today and that's right this is gonna be a career mode series on FIFA 15 I've decided to play with a team from the Bundesliga and that is Hertha Berlin you can see our starting 11 it will change a bit in the first season but still we have 8 million euros transfer budget and of course we'll be playing on world class at least for the beginning let me know in the comments below if you want to turn it up to legendary so here we are hopefully we'll be able to reach our objective for the first season and that will be to qualify for the European competitions. So there we have it, our objective for the domestic cup will be to reach the round of 32. Okay, should look for a striker, yeah definitely, because we'll have a look at the squad in just a second. Alright, and the league objective will be to qualify for the Euro League for the next season, of course, that is the main objective of this series and hopefully we'll be able you know to qualify for the Euro League of course we, we can win the domestic cup or we can finish in the top six I think it was but still let's move on to the squad all right so here is our squad this is the default formation I think I'm gonna stick with it at, for, at least for the moment and I, there will be some changes in the team so I'll go, I'm gonna make it I'm gonna make all the changes and I'll get back to you shortly all right so I've mixed it up a bit but still, here is our final starting 11. On goal we have Thomas Kraft, of course, maybe the one decent goalkeeper in the team at the moment. Okay, so in central defense we have Brooks and Lustenberger. Of course, Brooks is a very young talent. As you can see here, he's only 22 years of age, 71 overall. And Lustenberger will be our captain, 26 years of age. Those are our two, two of the central defenders, Brooks and Lustenberger. Maybe we can rotate Hatinga as well. We have another decent central back right here. Let me just have a look. Yeah, Langkamp was the other one. And most probably Janke, we're gonna say him, but still. Uh, on the right back, we have Peter Pekarik. He's the decent right back. And the substitute, we have Jenk. This guy is a bit older. As you can see, 32 years of age. Maybe we're gonna sell him in, in just a second, but still. On the left back we have Plattenhardt, 22 years of age, another young talent. I'm pretty much looking forward to see how he develops. In central defensive midfield we're gonna have Hosogai and Skelbret. Those two players will be our central defensive midfielders. We have also a couple of decent substitutions, you know, moving up. We have at Cam, we have Stoka and we have also some decent central attacking midfielders as Roni and Baumjohan. But still, I'm gonna use Stoker because he's 25 years of age. I think he has some decent potential. And I think he he's one of the best players in, in the team. But still, on the left midfield, we're gonna have Hai... Hai uh, what was his name? Ben Hatira. I just can't remember his first name, but still. We have Ben Hatira on the left mid. And on the right, we have Roy Behrens. And up top, we're gonna have at the moment with Salomon Kalu. Of course they, there may be some improvement uh, in the team but at the moment I think this is our best starting lineup. First up we'll see if we can loan out some players. We're gonna uh, maybe loan our this keeper. Yeah we're gonna set him on season loan of course. Maybe Andrich will be uh, loan listed for a season loan of course. Um, Mukhtar as well, we can set him on loan because he's 19 years of age, 65 overall at Cam, I don't think he is going to get any, you know, any minutes on the pitch. Schultz may, may be loan listed as well because, you know, at left mid I think I'm going to go with Ben Hatira at the moment. Those are the players who will be loan listed and now let's see who will be transfer listed. So there we have it, the most uh, you know the older players we're gonna sell most probably and this guy our right back will be sent to the transfer list We have Niemeyer a central defensive midfielder who will be transfer listed as well You know 30 years of age at 70 overall and Janker will be transfer listed as well Maybe loan out this player because he's 24 years of age and say 64 overall I don't think he'll get much better so yeah we're gonna we're gonna send him to the transfer list maybe yeah we're gonna sell him okay we have this striker here Wagner which who is 26 years of age 69 overall 
you know, um, I don't think I'm gonna use him, you know. Maybe we can get us get a decent amount of money for him as well. So yeah, let's send him to the transfer list. Okay, here is currently what, what we are looking for. We're looking for an attacker, basically a striker. But still, I want a pacey striker, you know, with uh, some decent physicality, you know, who can get on the end of crosses, who can score headers. And basically that's uh, what I want. Maybe I have one player in my mind, so maybe I'm gonna get him, but still, this is what we need at the moment. And we'll be looking for a center back as well, because, you know, I want a strong center back, a uh, young center back. And I have also a couple of names in my mind, so we'll see about that. And those two things are for some free contracts. Alright, so it's time to advance and also during the transfer windows I will be making those live commentaries and um, when there is no transfer window I will be making uh, post commentaries but still we have two emails, international management, okay I'm not interested at the moment. Sasha Burger, let's see, Paderborn are offering 425k. Mm. I'm gonna go with 525 counter offer for our goalkeeper and I'm currently looking to sell him because 24 years of age, 64 overall, it's not great. And also if we get a decent offer for some of our players, I think I may consider, you know, selling him, although he may not be transfer listed, but still hopefully we will be able to reach our objective for the season. But let's see another offer for Sash, uh, Sasha? Robert Andrich, uh, and we're gonna let him go on loan. Okay, they decided to match the offer. Great, we've sold the goalkeeper to Paderborn. That is fantastic. Okay, those are the strikers who I'm looking at. So basically, we have Remy, of course, a decent player. Everyone knows him about his pace. Uh, we have Ben Yeda from Toulouse. Uh, very another quite, you know quick forward. I'm scouting him at the moment to see his abilities. We have Eduardo Vargas, another pacey striker and of course the legend Victory Barbo. I think I'm gonna go for him. He's only 24 years of age and I think he has some decent potential. But let's see, we'll see in the end which striker are we gonna get. And also I'm looking for a center back, you know, a quite promising center back. Kurt Zuma, we can get him on loan maybe, I don't know, but still, we're gonna see. But those are the players who I'm looking at at the moment. We have also a couple of friendlies, you know, to play. Here's the first one against Osloa, I will be seeming those friendlies with uh, our reserves, you know, not the first team players, you know, because some of them might get injured in, during the simulation, but still, we'll be seeming those games in just a second. Alright, so the first friendly is gonna be against Osloa. Let's see if we'll get this win. I'm gonna skip it and it's 1-1. That's uh, a bit disappointing. Haraguchi gotta go and Sansone score the equalizer. But still, we get a 1-1 draw. Of course, there is nothing, you know, special about those friendlies. But still, here is our injury. I know, I knew it, it's gonna happen. And there it goes. Ronnie is injured for seven days. You know, it's not that bad. Okay, so let's move to the other friendly. Oh, we have an we have an offer for Sandro Wagner. I think we wanted to sell him. That's correct. And they give us one million, and he's worth like one million, 1.2 million. Okay, I'm gonna bump it up by 1.3 to see what what they're gonna say. And we have a transfer offer. Yes, they've decided to match the offer for Wagner. And now let's get into the match with Leicester City. And let's see who is playing Baum Johan. Okay, that's decent. And let's see, skip and another 1-1 one, one draw. Okay, more open the scoring and Haraguchi once again and scores. Okay, that's decent. And after the Liverpool game, we have one week break and then we are starting with the Bundesliga, but that will be in the next episode. Uh, finally, I will be simming the Liverpool game and maybe we'll be wrapping up the video. Players sold, all right, that's great. And not feeling, hey boss, I like to play every match, I appreciate a rest, but I'm feeling a bit, okay, he wants a rest, sure, okay, you can get your rest, let's see, Ronnie, let's uh, change him to Baumjohan, okay, 
Usually, you know, players get requests for playing, but now he wants a rest. Okay, if I understood it correctly, you know, because I was reading it between the, you know, between the words. And once again, Haraguchi scores. Oh my, what's with that player? Okay, let's keep it, and we win 2-0 against Liverpool, oh my goodness, but look at this, Ward was on the go for Liverpool, but still a decent team. So yeah, thank you very much for watching, a like is pretty much appreciated, leave me some feedbacks if you want me to get a player in this transfer window, but I'm pretty much, you know, happy with the team so far, and unless we don't get an offer for somebody, I won't be selling anybody. But still, that was it for this one, I just can't stop talking. And yeah, thank you very much for watching, like and subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you in the next one. Until then, of course, take care.